action. Smile, babe. Yeah. You're getting your truck. Warning, this video contains super awesome content not suitable for people who don't enjoy super awesomeness. Viewer discretion advised. Welcome back guys. On today's episode, we're going to buy a new car. You know, when I see a car like this, first thing I do is I say, would you look at this? You know what I mean? Yeah, sure. And we thought Bolt and Bolt would bring you along for the ride. Um, what we are after today is a Toyota 4Runner TRD Pro in Voodoo Blue. I already have a name. What's the name? Mystique. Mystique. She hasn't even got the truck yet, it's Mystique. Yep. So we'll put a picture like here, or here, or <laughs> here. We'll put a picture somewhere right now of uh, the car. It's pretty cool looking, huh? So that's her dream car. I got the Red Rocket, which you guys have seen before, and that was kind of my dream car. That was more of a Valentine's Day gift to myself a few years ago, but... <laughs> I want to be with the woman I love on Valentine's Day. We have red bagels. <laughs> okay. Yeah. This Valentine's Day, it's her turn. We're going to go get her, her truck, and we're going to bring you guys along for the ride. A few tips. Always buy it near the end of the month. For us, it's February 19th. Two, whatever they have posted online, like let's just say it's $50,000, the dealership's always gonna put their buying package into it. Never accept their terms and conditions on their buying package. Always request the invoice. Few fees that are acceptable are the state taxes and the processing fees that's legit but as far as their interior protection their paint protection their unlimited mile uh air in the tire warranty whatever goofy things that these people come up with um never accept it and then when they finally say fine always go a thousand dollars under what their final offer is um the one we're looking at is a 2019 or 20 i can't remember but 2019. but here we go We've infiltrated the dealership. Waiting impatiently. We've seen the car. She's beautiful. She's exactly what I want. But we don't want them to know that. So you remember that um, that package I was telling you guys about earlier? Here it is. We're gonna show you guys the car. See how this goes. Incognito. I don't want anybody to know me. All right, guys. We're in Mystique. Hopefully. Hopefully, that's going to be the name of her. Um, this thing's loaded. It's pretty cool. It's got a little sunroof. I always said I wouldn't buy another car with a sunroof. But uh, we got four-wheel drive in this piece. It's got a front brush guard, a rear brush guard. Um, we're going to take this thing for a spin. And uh, we'll let you guys know how it feels. What'd you think, babe? I like it a lot. Did you like it? I do. Did you like the did you like the knocking coming from it? Customer states, my engine is knocking. 
Oh, it was beautiful. <laughs> Sounds of success. What was your favorite part? The whole thing. The, the whole thing. The vehicle being high up. A nice smooth ride. I got heated seats like you do finally. Being high up was my favorite and being protected. Did you hear that everybody? She likes being high. Round one. <laughs> Finish him. Go. Pop. See? See? Pop. Pop. See? You left yourself open, Dad. And protected, so I don't know why I married this guy. <laughs> we just asked if we could put the car on a lift because there was a knocking noise. And um, salesman came back to me and said no because of liability reasons. First thing I said to him was bullshit. So if you guys go to buy a car, by all means, uh, request the vehicle to be put on a lift. So it's an investment, just like a house. When, so it when, needs to be inspected. Whenever you have a problem with uh, getting what you want, right away just ask hey, your let me ask, let me talk to your manager. Mother? No. <laughs> um, but they were cool about it. They put it up on a lift. They let us look at it. All right, so we couldn't really come to terms on the blue one that we test drove. We didn't record it, but we test drove a green one too. I didn't like the green one. She said she would settle for the green one, and when she said that she would settle for the green one, that's when I knew that we had to make a deal on this blue one. And it just stands out with the blue, so the blue is where my heart's at. The blue one doesn't need tires, um, not yet. We could probably go a year before it needs tires and the, and the brakes at least a year and a half. So that's really why we lean more towards the blue. The ladder rack on the blue is kind of starting to peel off the roof, so we'll have to fix that. But um, yeah, we're gonna try and make a deal on this blue one. Stay tuned. Question, Kelly? Number one, how dare you? No, God! No, God, please, no! 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 Oh my God! Okay, it's happening. Everybody stay calm. What's the Everybody procedure, calm. everyone? What's the procedure? Stay calm! Wait, 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 wait. Everybody just calm down! Hi guys, I'm Amy from the finance department. Please come and see me when you're ready for your new Toyota. All right guys, it only took five <laughs> hours, six hours, but we are now the new proud owners of a 2019 Toyota 4Runner TRD Pro Voodoo Blue. We knew we were gonna be walking away with it, we just didn't want them to know that. Man, look at these tires, baby. Here we go. Overlanding, here we come. How you feel, babe? I'm excited, but I'm cold. You're excited, but cold. Okay, let's do this transfer. All right, guys. We'll do another video later on in the morning. And thanks for rolling.
this is our active traction button traction control off and then our locking differentials here this is crawl control that's pretty sick like if you're going up something and you want to maintain a certain speed this is leather red stitching TRD in the headrest somebody put these on there comes with a nice little divider my wife has already got her her smell good in here her perfume stuff and then this is supposed to hold Kleenexes but whatever everybody's different I can turn this button on here uh, this will turn a outlet on in the back this is hooked up to my fog light other than that your basic Toyota setup here uh, smaller display but you got a bunch of bunch of apps in this thing just gotta zoom in on that So yeah, this thing is pretty, pretty loaded. It's got, we got a sunroof in this thing. Bench seats in the back. Carbon fiber paneling here. I'm sure it's fake carbon fiber, but it's carbon fiber. My wife will be using this as her daily commuter. Me, this will be my weekend warrior machine. Take it uh, camping, put the bikes in here and see where I can get to, hook a trailer to it, whatever, and uh, yeah, so if you guys uh, enjoyed the video, smash the like button for me, uh, got any questions about the truck, or you know, if I, what my plans are with it, leave a comment, and uh, yeah, we'll see you on the next go around. Maybe.